calculating the observed frequency for a sound source moving away from an observer using the following equation. So in this case, we have uh, our observer and we have the sound source moving away from the observer. Okay, so sound is traveling in this direction, so we have the speed of sound. And then we have the speed of the actual source moving away from the observer. Um, so we have to account for that difference. So uh, as that happens, so since the sound source is moving away, the sound waves, the wavelengths get stretched out, thereby decreasing the frequency or the apparent frequency. So let's go ahead and write down our equation here. The frequency is going to be equal to the uh, frequency of the source. Um, and then we have this ratio of the, of the speeds of sound and the speed of the source. Uh, our, the s frequency of the source is 440 hertz. Um, our speed of sound, again, is 330 meters per second. And then the speed of our source is 25 meters per second. So when we go ahead and plug this information in, we get 440, um, and then we have this ratio of 330 over 330 plus 25, and we get a final value of 410 hertz. So as you can see, as you can see, answer choice D is correct. Um, as you can see, though, 410 hertz, this is a decrease in frequency, which kind of confirms our uh, Doppler effect.